Blast Paris 2023 stickers being too overpriced has become one of the biggest debates within the Counter-Strike investing community. With this major being one of the most unpredictable majors ever, it's really hard to tell what's right or wrong. With the Blast Paris stickers going up in price during the 75% off sale, it has been one of the biggest talking points to this debate. But many factors such as hollows now being pink rarity could be contributing to the higher prices. Not only this, but the release of Counter-Strike 2 could be creating creating FOMO, which could also be inflating prices. With all these different factors, it has created a conflict between people who believe that Paris tickets will crash and burn and people that think that the prices are justified and can only go up. Well, what if there was a way we could truly find out whether the Blast Paris Holo stickers are overpriced? To find out the answer, I decided to compile a bunch of data to find the truth behind all of this. After researching and using data I found on the Steam market, I came up with this. This is a graph which shows us the average holo prices from each major during the 75% off sale. As you can see, most major holo stickers are within the 70 cents to $2 range, with RMR having the cheapest holo prices on average being 15 cents, and Atlanta 2017 having some of the most expensive stickers being $2.02 .02 for a holo sticker on average. But where does Paris 2023 fit into all of this? Well, right about here, towering above every major sticker collection is Paris 2023 with an average holo price of $4.63. Now most people will look at this and instantly come to the conclusion that Paris 2023 is overpriced. But we need to remember that we're comparing previous major holo stickers that had a 15.98% chance to unbox compared to Paris, which is a 3.2% chance to be unboxed. Many other factors play into account as to whether a sticker is overpriced or not, such as supply, demand, and investor demand. On the topic of investor demand, we know that Blast Paris has some of the most investor demand for a major ever, thanks to Stockholm and Antwerp being some of the best investments in recent memory. Due to the amount of stickers being stored away in storage units, this could explain why these stickers are so inflated. In terms of supply, applications for these stickers have always been below Stockholm and Antwerp stickers, even though capsule unboxings have been higher than Antwerp. This again could be a factor of more people storing away hollow stickers in storage units due to investor demand which decreases application rates. Also, the high prices for these stickers will be stopping people from crafting as often as old sticker collections. We also know the estimated amount of Paris capsules is the highest we've ever seen from a major which is quite concerning. As for demand, we know it's been strong and the high price that the sellers are demanding for buyers only justifies this. With Paris stickers being some of the best stickers we've received inside of Counter-Strike, the high demand makes a lot of sense. If we take all of these factors into consideration, the high price for these stickers is justified if you solely want to craft with the Blast Paris stickers, but as an investment, it may be risky. This is because I decided to compile more data on the Blast Paris 2023 stickers. This time, I took the prices from the 75% off sale from each major and compared them to the price nine months after the stickers were released, which is the same amount of time there will be between the Blast Paris 75% off sale and the Copenhagen 2024 major. On this graph, you can see some of the best investments within a nine month period of the major sticker collections being released. The blue represents the price during the 75% off sale, and the red shows the price after a nine month period. Of course, in first place, we see Catavisa 2014 seeing an average holo price going for $1.21 to $20.48. And as we get to the bottom of the list, we can see Paris's current price, which is $4.63. When we compare it to all the other majors, it becomes clear that for Paris 2023 holo stickers to double in price in nine months, it would have to be a slightly more successful investment compared to Katowice 2015. Now this analysis right here is quite worrying and the data is outright telling us that the Blast Paris 2023 stickers are overpriced for investing. This data doesn't mean the Blast Paris stickers will decrease in price, it just means that it might just stay quite stable until the Copenhagen Major. But factors such as sticker crafting being way more popular nowadays and hollows now being pink rarity could prove this all wrong. The market is in an unpredictable spot right now and anything can change rapidly. 
But in terms of the long-term sustainability of Blast Para stickers, it's all up to Valve as they can choose whether to release boarded stickers again or not. With most stickers being big returns after 12 months of their release, it might be hard to predict how Paris will perform long term. But for the 9 month period Paris has before the first CS2 major, it's looking as though the hollow stickers from the major might just be overpriced for the time being. This video is sponsored by Skinflow. Make sure you click the link in the description so you can get a 2% extra bonus on your skin value. After that, comment flow so we know you use the link for your chance to win $50 balance on the website. Make sure to like, subscribe, turn on notifications and comment for your chance to win an AK-47 Nightwish. Thanks for watching.